Six Iroquois high school students are being disciplined after a bus driver was attacked on a JCPS school bus. It was like a, a, a mob, mass mob trying to beat up one guy. And it, it's uh, despicable. It's, it, it's, it's nasty. That was John Stovall's reaction to watching cell phone video of the fight, which has been circulating on social media. Stovall is the president of the Teamsters Local 783. The video shows several Iroquois students crowd around the driver last Friday, punching and kicking him as he tried to get off the bus. It kind of made me sick to think kids could act this way. And all that guy's trying to do is drive school bus, pick him up, take him home in safe fashion. JCPS says six students involved in the assault were disciplined, but the district doesn't expel. In a separate incident, Seneca High School's principal sent a letter to families on Wednesday, saying a student who shares a school bus with Seneca students started axing out and attacked the driver. LMPD took that student into custody. They should be, you know, prosecuted, and they should be kicked out of school, and they shouldn't be allowed on the school bus again, period. JCPS released a statement addressing the recent violence. It reads, the safety of our students and staff is always our top priority. We must all work together to ensure students and staff are following bus safety rules. Stovall says more must be done to stop violent acts like these from happening again. I don't care what happened, what provoked it, no one should treat another human being like that. And until they're held accountable for what they did, this will continue on every bus in Jefferson County. Jamie Mays, WLKY News.